Hello everyone, Mike Arnold here, co-founder of Path Trading Partners along with Bob Iacchino, C Limited. This was brought up on our live stream this past weekend by one of the viewers. Thank you very much. And we covered the potential reversal. I did not cover, and I don't know why, what the targets were. So this was where we had the bars for the potential pullbacks and everything else on Sunday when we did the live stream. And now we've rallied up, and it gave us a target of 101.86. Now that was from, this is from the long one. So this is back from the lows on the 23rd of March to this bar. It gave us 101.86 and 109.21. So it hit the 101.86 on the gap up today, filling the gap. Remember, gaps are like magnets, and then closing, still not positive, but closing a yeah, better better position than it started the uh, than from the lows. So now we're gonna come, I'm leaving those on here. For some reason, it wouldn't let me grab this. I wanna bring up the retracements now. Now I can move this back. I'm just gonna go up to this reversal bar right here, potential reversal bar, and give you the new key levels. It's only gonna shift by a little bit. So 110.84 and 119.20 are the next uh, targets to the upside. We're in overbought condition, but that doesn't mean we can't get more overbought. Key pullback now, we talk. look at the 12 and a half. This is a prior little resistance ledge, and then we had the breakout on Monday. So watching about 94.14 to about 93.32 is the first level of support on any pullback. If we did pull back below that, I'd be watching 85.79, so essentially 86. Those are the key levels we're watching for C Limited, and there's no divergent sell, I mean, if you go way back here, there's, but we've had a number of divergences. This is just in a power uptrend. So what we would be doing if we were in it would just be raising our stop along with it and trailing, especially below the daily rotation zone. So we have for you on C-Limited, and we'll talk to everyone later. Bye for now.